Previews for LEGO Horizon Adventures have just released and here's everything that we've learned so far. The new footage showcases the first hour or so of gameplay starting with a montage of Ross raising a baby Aloy. We then make our way to Mother's Heart's village, stopping in a few tutorial sections and exploring our surroundings for hidden chests. Once we get there, Aloy gets her focus and discovers that it highlights weak spots on enemies. We also learn that firing arrows through a campfire will light them and do extra damage or remove flammable obstacles. The same happens with sparking electricity, which can activate certain panels. While at Mother's Heart's village, there's a ton of places to visit, including the old tree where you upgrade your character using studs. In other areas, you can customize the appearance of buildings and complete community jobs. More importantly, in my opinion, is Teb's Tailor, which allows you to buy outfits using studs, including ones based on Horizon Zero Dawn, Lego City, Ninjago, and even custom outfits. Does that mean the character customizer makes an appearance in this game? We then continue exploring and come across the ruins of a city as a tall neck walks along. Climbing on top of it grants a classic gold brick, which seems to have returned as a completion meter for Horizon Adventures. While traveling, you'll have frequent combat encounters where you can either try to hide in tall grass, use big destructible objects as weapons, or simply pick up enemies and throw them off a cliff. If you take any damage, you can use healing items, and if you're defeated, your co-op partner can revive you. Towards the end of the demo, the town is attacked by Eclipse cultists, which have kidnapped several citizens. We learned that Helis was the one responsible through a hologram and end up getting ambushed by him. Thankfully, Aloy makes it out, though Ross isn't so lucky. LEGO Horizon Adventures releases in less than a month for PlayStation 5, Nintendo Switch, and PC, with a deluxe edition as well as a pre-order bonus providing additional in-game outfits.